Hello, my name is Walter Unglob, and this is how to convert degrees into bevels. So to convert degrees into bevels, we have to consider a bevel gear. And a bevel gear works in the following manner. It's a gear that has many bevels around it, and it'll turn either clockwise or counterclockwise. And it's usually connected to other bevel gears where the angles have to be consistent in order to turn some sort of shaft or operate some sort of machinery. And in order to convert a degree as an angle into a bevel, we have to first know how many bevels a given gear has. So if we consider a bevel gear with 60 bevels all around it, then the conversion factor can be calculated by knowing how many degrees there are in one revolution. So one revolution would be one period, and that's equal to 360 degrees for a circle. So if we consider a bevel gear with 60 bevels, then the conversion can be found by dividing the total number of degrees in one revolution by the total number of bevels in the gear. And this turns out to be, for this example, 6 degrees per bevel. So, if I want to know how many bevels have to pass a certain point to turn a certain angle, like say 90 degrees, then I simply use my conversion, which I calculated by knowing how many total bevels my gear has. So I take 90 degrees and I divide by my conversion, which is 6 degrees per bevel. So by dividing by my conversion, I'm multiplying by one bevel and dividing by 6 degrees. The degrees cancel out and I'm left with 15 bevels. So 15 bevels, 15 of these grooves have to pass this certain point and that will characterize a revolution of just 90 degrees in the system. My name is Walter Unglob, and this is How to Convert Degrees into Bevels.